Hey, what is up guys? Guitar Rock here and welcome back to another FWTR video. Alright, we're going to talk a bit about equipments today. So, I figured I'd do this video since there are plenty of... I noticed many of my guildmates and some people on channel 1, they feel discouraged to try out Tower of Dawn Hell. And Partly of the reason is because they don't have this set. So this is the Shadow Ruler set. And it activates only in Tower of Dawn. Um, definitely uh, outside of Tower of Dawn this set is useless. But if you play TOD a lot and the content uh, and when it's activated in Tower of Dawn. Definitely the defense by 2000 and increase all allies attack by 2870 that gives uh, a very significant boost to your entire team so this set is great right definitely one of the best set you can have for tower of dawn uh, regardless you are clearing content for tower of dawn heart or hell definitely uh, by having this set it would help you progress further especially if you are new but I see lots of misconception. Lots of players think that they cannot clear Tower of Dawn Hell without this set. So I did manage to clear uh, TOD Hell this month and last month. Granted that uh, many players did mention that these two months it was quite easy. I've heard that lots of people were saying that this month was a lot easier than last month. So that is true to a certain extent but Definitely, um, if you are still hesitating to start Tower of Dawn Hell uh, without this set, I, hon I honestly think you can make it. So you shouldn't uh, doubt yourself, you should try at least attempt some of the stages and give it a shot, you know. In terms of uh, equipments, definitely unprecedented. You don't really need this set this month. I don't I can't think of any stage that you would benefit for having unprecedented this month. So yeah, if you don't have unprecedented and you don't have the shadow ruler set, don't worry. Uh, just give it a go. You never know. Uh, you might succeed. So yeah, let's oh my god, it's red color. Uh yeah, eight hours left. Let me claim this. Uh, let me show you guys since now we have this uh, selection ticket 6 star selection ticket I'll briefly tell you guys uh, what set is needed and not needed this month Alright, we'll start from slot 1 So Iron Fist of the e from the East um, is a good set Like definitely one of the best set in slot 1 You don't need that set for this month To clear Tower of Dawn Hell You don't need Unassailable, you don't need Bloody Melee Out of Flame Kingdom's Tailor. To be honest, I don't think you need any of this set to clear TOD this month. Yeah, uh, I'll be honest with you guys. Like, definitely none of these set are uh, crucial. Definitely, uh, Iron Fist from the East and Unassailable will make your job a lot more easier. It's definitely going to make your uh, TOD run much more smoother. Uh, definitely, but you don't really need them. Be honest with you guys, I don't have uh, both uh, Iron, Fe Iron Fist and Unassailable. I did make it through this month and last month. So slot 2, uh, you don't need the Immortal this month. Luckily, uh, managed to find a strat. Uh, I did craft a strat for, I believe it was floor 118. Uh, many players believe that they need either Immortal or Unassailable, but I did it without either one of it. So yeah, uh, you don't really need this set either. Cave Chaser, definitely Cave Chaser is useful to have. But yeah, this month, I guess you don't really need it as well. Taunting Busybody. Now this is uh, one of the more crucial sets this month, I would say. Uh, the entire team of this month is centered around aggro tanks. So if you follow my strat from... I believe it was from floor 117 to floor 125. Uh, I would say at least 
90% of the floors require, requires you to have aggro tank either Chris or Jack uh, so yeah if you have this set it will help you out a whole lot of bunch because the aggro increase is 50% right here and this set is cool because uh, it doesn't restrict you to uh, equip it on a certain type of character there are some other sets that aggro sets that require you to have a defense type character only but for this particular set Haunting Busybody you can equip it on anyone which is cool alright slot 3 so definitely um, for this month I would say definitely a strategy support system and the high human guardian is useful for Tower of Dawn Hell other than that uh, the rest of it you might not really need definitely um, uh, Beast Rain I think most people know that it's more of a BOH set Cuckoo Rain just go if you have this it will make your job uh, it will make your life a lot more easier you can secure the boss kills in less turns than needed in terms of slot 4 uh, Sharp Advance was really really helpful to me this month I think one of the months uh, I have this equipped on my one of the floor or two of the floors I have this equipped on my Ian and I was able to build Lord Gage that way you don't really need this for Tower of Dawn Hell uh, it's more of a I think it's more of a BOH set I could be wrong but definitely maybe Ghost Step definitely much more useful Defender of the Earth and Devil Knight in terms of slot 5 definitely if you want to clear Tower of Dawn Hell my advice to you guys is to have at least one Omni set if you want to make your life a lot more easier uh, try to get two but definitely this is a must if you are trying to clear uh, TOD Hell because there are some minions who have uh, this arm and stuff like that which you cannot obtain immunity from your traits uh, you don't really need this set, you don't really need this set this month this set is useful to have useful to have but not 100% required so does this set uh, yeah none of these sets are that useful maybe Angel Knight Angel Knight is versatile, you can use it anywhere BOH uh, PVE, PVP Tower of Dawn Magical Marksman is good as well but too bad it's I think this is a ring and that's a boots I don't know it's just bad typing uh, Klein is pretty good as well alright guys I uh, hope that answers your question I think many of you guys have been asking and if you still have yet to start Tower of Dawn Hell this month my advice for you guys is to actually give it a go give it a try you never know uh, you might actually make it this month as far as this a six star go I'm going to get a cuckoo ranger go I think I don't have that set it's definitely going to improve my red score all right there we have it should I claim this one oh no it's empty what is happening is empty nah it's this tree changing future progressive present oblivious past hmm I'm still deciding which one to get I'll probably get it next month. I'm gonna stack all. Tr I'm gonna stack three, and I'll get three of it next month. All right, guys, that's it for the video. Uh, let me know if you guys find this video helpful, and let me know what set are you lacking off that is preventing you from starting Tower of Dawn Hell. Let me know in the comment section below. I'm curious. All right, guys, as usual, stay tuned in the channel for more awesome FWTR content. And if you like the video, give it a like and you can share it with your friends. And you can subscribe to the channel if you're new. And as usual, I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a nice day. Goodbye.